I haven't done any bag reviews in a while, so I thought I'd review some of the new stuff I got in. This is a Filson original briefcase bag that I just got today. I bought it online um, from Amazon. It came from, a, actually shipped from a company called Outland USA. Um, but I just searched on Amazon and found this bag. I've been doing some research on Filson and decided on getting their um, original briefcase, which is just a regular satchel basically. It's just barely big enough to hold my laptop and a notepad. Um, don't really need to carry anything else usually. If I do, I have a day pack I can carry around stuff, but this is just for carrying on my work stuff. So I've been looking for a good bag. Um, this, the dimensions of this, you can probably look it up on filson.com, but it's just a normal size satchel. It's um, 16 inches wide by 12 inches high, and 4 inches thick, so it's just barely big enough to hold this stuff. Um, look at the hardware here. It's pretty good quality, it's a bridal leather all around. This is the handles here. Uh, the thing is, I thought this leather would go all the way down the length of the bag and be tacked here. But if you look, it just comes down right there and it's stitched. So, kinda, we'll have to see how long that'll last. It's not, it is double stitched though, I guess, so it's probably going to last a good long time, depending on how you treat it. But it would have been made more sense if it came all the way down here and looped around as support. Uh, same with this side. It comes down just right there and it's stitched. So I um, imagine if you yank hard enough on this, it's going to start to come undone after a while. But just got to take care of it, I guess. And there's a little clasp that holds the little flap over the zipper part here. So, so let me show you what I got in here. Inside I've got just a couple of notepads. Well, let, actually, let me, let me zoom out and see if you can get a good idea of how thick that is. That's out of the way. So it's just... So you see it's just barely wide enough to hold the notepad. You're not going to be able to get a lunch in there or a bottle of water. Just big enough to hold the essentials, I guess, which in my case is just a couple of notepads for work. And inside here you got enough room just to carry. It's got two, three, si two side pockets. And on one side I've got the uh, tech stuff charger for my laptop um, let's get all that stuff in there mouse charger for my iPhone pencils and there's a laptop here the thing is it just this thing is just barely wide enough to squeeze the laptop in. Notice the sides, the zippers are kind of sharp. And when you pull out the laptop, they kind of rub against the zipper, so it's going to probably scratch the surface. But since it's just my work laptop and I've had this thing for like three years, I don't really care. <laughs> um, it's got this on a the other side pocket it also has got is got like little pockets for business cards and pens. I don't usually use those because when you start to fill this up, then it reduces the amount of space in the middle section for this guy. So that's a 15 inch laptop. And if you look, whoop, I don't want to drop it. That's my IBM ThinkPad, 15 inch, and it's almost exactly the dimensions of the Filson bag so it just can barely fit in there Put that there it's not as spacious as I was hoping it'd be um, given the dimensions 
And that's the inside there. Let me see if you can get a light in there so you can see. This the middle part. See, as you start to put stuff into the side pockets here, it, this stuff is going to kind of billow out. This one will billow out. And it will reduce the space in the middle part. So it's just four inches wide total. And you're going to have to split the space between the middle part where the heavier items will go books, laptops, and the stuff here on the side pockets, which is like keys, wallets, extra glasses, another notepad, garbage bags, paracord. This thing will kind of bellow out with time. So we'll see how it works. But this is pretty good material. I mean, it's that 220 canvas, I guess, or something like that. I don't know. You can search it online, but there's the Filson tag there. Close it. And there it is.